Stop. Please just stop. I need you to stop. I want you to stop. I absolutely beg you to stop. But if I say this to you, do you stop? Do you ever stop to see where your life is, where it's going, and what the fuck you think you're doing here? You see, you don't have the right to touch me, and I don't have the right to touch you. You don't have the right to interfere with me, and I don't have the right to interfere, interfere with you. And every time I make a misstep, you think, good for you. No, I'm human. I make mistakes, yes, but mistakes are rarely intentional. Intentional harm is something we don't talk enough about today. Intentional theft is something that we know occurs today. And you look at these people and you go, I don't get it. I got the same life lessons as you. Why is it that I'm the guy who's honest and true, but you're married to that shitbag who lied to you? In America, we have rights. And your rights are being abated, literally unafforded, by people around you who want to steal from you, take from you, harm you. And you keep fucking around as if someone doesn't care. No, people do care about their rights. But they never associate their own rights with other people's rights. You see, if you take my rights, then I might want to turn around and take your rights. And did you actually ever think about the retaliation or repercussions to the responsibilities you have for your stupid ass, stupidville decisions? I think not, because your attitude is who will ever know? Why would they know? How would they know? How would I get caught? The truth is, you're always caught in front of God's house. You are always looked down on by the Lord's home meaning he has windows to the soul he knows every child in america every child around the world he made everyone but you just think he doesn't do that there's been some marvelous films about santa claus delivering packages all around the world at christmas time in which they show all these elves working their ass off to help support santa in the delivery service of that happiness at holiday time the truth is they sort of remind me about how angels work and angels work sort of like that. When people take over other people's rights, ruin their opportunities in life, angels have to work mighty hard in overtime to fix things, to bring things back, to repair things, and to do things that God would have them do to enlighten the world. 